Camping World Stadium is alive tonight. One of the most notable soccer tournaments in the world happening there right now, the Copa America. Orlando is one of the host cities for the month-long tournament. News 6 reporter Troy Campbell is there now. Troy, what's the energy like out there? A lot of excitement and a lot of uh, country flags from South America. Now the game started about an hour ago. The score is still at 0-0. Not only is this the first time the city of Orlando has hosted a game in this tournament, but it's also the first time Copa America has been held outside of South America. The tournament is in its 100th year this year, making it the longest running tournament of its kind. 16 teams from the Americas competing for the championship game. That will take place in New Jersey at the end of this month. Now back in November, the city of Orlando announced several games would be held here, saying it's economic impact. It's similar to the bowl games back in December. They're expecting to have a $30 million economic impact for the city. Soccer fans in Central Florida excited Copa America has made its way to not only the U.S., but right here in Orlando. Uh, I think it's great because uh, it's like a celebration of uh, uh, Latino, Hispanic, and Costa Rica per way. That's great. Uh, well, I'm excited for the Brazil and Haiti. Now that's going to be a great game on this Wednesday. Nine other cities in the U.S. They're also hosting games in the Copa America tournament this month. And this game, that's not all for the city of Orlando. Two more games will be hosted here on Monday and Wednesday. Live in Orlando, Troy Campbell, News 6. All right, you have fun out there, Troy.